Hey everyone, Sacred Zone is here for whatsyourtech.ca and in this video segment we're going to look at Air Video, a free iPhone app that lets you stream media from your Windows or Mac over 3G and Wi-Fi. The beauty of Air Video is that you can choose the folders in the iTunes playlist that you actually want to stream over to your iPhone. But the tab that we really want to look at here is Remote because the server pin is ultimately what enables the connection wirelessly over 3G or Wi-Fi to your iPhone. Now you can actually test the connection of this whole setup uh, now I have two routers set up, so that's why AirVideo is not really liking my my um, my setup here. But I can actually get around that. I'm going to get a prompt here in a second that's telling me that the connection test failed, but that's actually not the case. Notice also that we got subtitles and logs. The logs are showing you what you've converted. So here we are with the iPhone, and uh, here's just the basic menu. I had actually set up a pin before, but now it's not working. That's the thing with the pins is that. Uh, you know, you have to, every time you, you, you open up a, the computer, you have to go with a new pin. So I'm just going to put in the one that I had showed you before and press save. Now it's going to validate. Shouldn't take too long usually. And there we go. It's all set up. It's the third one on the list. Click that. And then I've got the two folders and the one playlist that I had allocated for the iPhone through Air Video. Let's go to TV shows. And I have a few uh, seasons of The Wire here. So I'm going to go to season three and just check uh, an episode on there. Now, what typically happens is that a lot of the videos that you may have may not be compatible with the iPhone to begin with. It is a nice interface, though, and it's pretty easy to, to navigate and to understand where everything is. Now, as we look at the list of videos, and most likely this may not play right off the bat. Now, if I just choose one of the episodes here, you'll see that it offers live conversion and it offers convert. So live conversion means it'll convert as you're playing it, whereas convert means you'll have to convert it before you actually play it. Is there a quality difference? Yes, there is. Uh, with live conversion, it'll probably be a little bit less as opposed to if you had converted it beforehand. So uh, that's something that you'll, uh, and I'm just going to demonstrate here live conversion because obviously it needs to. I can't play the video, so I'm going to go into landscape mode. And it, it, this depends, too, on what format the video is in. Like, I mean, sometimes there might be letterboxing, sometimes it might not. It really... Uh, it really depends on what you have. It's hit or miss. So I can interact with the video, as you can see, but I can't really skip uh, anything there because it's being converted on the fly, whereas if I had converted beforehand, I could. So that's just, uh, that's basically Air Video. And I mean, we can even have a, a list of conversions. But that's pretty much it. That's the app in a nutshell. For whatsyourtech.ca, I'm Tech Ritzonis.